Question 2.1. Complete the sentences. Choose answer from the box. Electrons, gamma rays, neutrons, nuclei, protons. In nuclear power stations, energy is released from uranium nuclei. That's good. And the uranium in figure 2 splits into two parts and releases three. Well, if you look at the diagram here, these are the three particles released, and these particles are neutrons. So that would be three neutrons. The process of nuclear fission, fission means to break, so fission is endothermic, it is bond breaking, and releases electromagnetic radiation in the form of gamma rays. Use the physics equation sheet to answer questions 2.2 and 2.3. Three. So for 2.2, write down the equation which links energy, E, power, P, and time, T, together. And that equation will be, if you to write it down, P, power, is energy over time. Or power is the rate of energy. And we can rewrite that equation, therefore, this is therefore, we can rearrange it to make energy subject by cross-multiplying P with T. So energy is power times time. Question 2.3. A nuclear power station has a power output of 500 megawatts that's megawatts calculate the energy output in 3600 seconds that's one hour because that's 60 times 60 60 for four minutes and 60 for seconds give your answers in joules so first of all we have to write down the conversion here the 500 megawatts is 500 times 10 to power 6 10 to power 6 means a million so mega is a million watts so we change the m to a million and a million a quick way to write it is to say 10 to power 6 or 1 and 6 0 so we're going to use our equation we know that power is energy over time we're calculating energy so we have to make e the subject energy equals power times time and we now need to plug in the values 500 times 10 to power 6 the power times time in seconds 3600 and that give 1.8 times 10 to power 12 joules and the final answer is 1.8 times 10 to power 12 joules that's the energy output question 2.4 radioactive waste produced by nuclear power stations has a long half-life. So just one precaution taken to reduce the hazard caused by radioactive waste from power stations. There are few precautions but one of them is to bury the radioactive waste underground or you can put the radioactive waste in a cooling pond. You can transport the radioactive waste in a secure vessels. Make sure you store the radioactive waste in a metal containers. Another one would be to cover the radioactive waste in concrete. Question 2.5. Nuclear power stations do not generate electricity every day of the year. One nuclear power station generate electricity for 92% of a year. One year is 365 days. Calculate the number of days during the year that the nuclear power station generate electricity. Two marks. Well, the number of days will be equal to 92% which is 92 over 100 times the total number of a day in a year times 365 and that gives us 335.8 days so you can write 335.8 or you might write 336 or 335 so but the answer is 335.8 days in a year